Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. <clears throat> um, please uh, forgive any errors in these um, equations. If I go too fast, I'm sorry. Um, I will work better in the future to make these clearer. Uh, in the meantime, I do hope they help those um, who are looking for help. Thanks. And um, if you can do better, please, 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 publish. Publish what you know. Biology, biochemistry, physics, mathematics, engineering of any kind, electrical, mechanical, bio. Show us what you know. Share what you know. A. Reducing fractions, or fancy way of saying it is uh, fractions or rational expressions. Let's uh, keep in mind, we want to, uh, <clears throat> we're going to want to factor uh, numerator and denominator as much as possible. So remember N and D, numerator and denominator. So let's take a look at uh, reducing, uh, or let's take a look at this rational expression, x squared minus 2x minus 8 x over x squared minus 9x plus 20. Now, we can't, we can't just cancel x squared, x squared. That's just, that's not going to work because it doesn't, um, it doesn't share, each one of these um, terms does not share the same factor. x squared and 2x, maybe, because you've got the x there, but the 8 does not, so we can't reduce that. But we can factor it. So let's take a look at factoring it and see what we get. Um, let's try x minus 4, uh, x plus 2, x squared, we're foiling, just to check, foil, uh, x squared plus 2x minus 4x, so that's negative 2x minus 8, okay, that works, and let's try the other one, x and x, um, 4 and 5, so it's positive and that's negative, so it's going to be a negative and a negative. So it's easy. 4 and 5, that should work. x squared minus 5x minus 4x plus 20. Yeah. All right, so now um, this rational expression up here now becomes, just because we have x minus 4 and x minus 4, we can now cancel those, giving us our final uh, rational expression as x plus 2 over x minus 5. And um, so there you go. And this, in fact, uh, this, this, uh, this rational expression and this rational expression and this rational expression are all equal. 1 equals 2 equals 3 because they're all equivalent fractions. Thanks for watching. And uh, that's equivalent fractions, F-R-A-C-T-I-O-N-S. Um, again, it's the, am I going too fast? Forgive me, please. Um, if you can do better, please publish. Thanks.